The year is coming to a close, and here in SoFlow, we absolutely know how to ring in the new year right. Back in studio with us with What's Shaken for New Year's Eve is Manager of Events and Community Affairs at the Miami Herald, Ray Duenas. Ray, welcome back. Good to see you. Thank you for having me. Happy holidays. Have I, have I not seen you since when? It's been crazy. Before Halloween, since uh, summertime. Summertime. Wow, time flies. Yes, yes. 2022, gone. Gone. 2023, around the corner. Miami rings How are we in bringing it year? in? We are, we are kicking it off at where? 11. Cardi B was at our Basel, had a performance, gonna have another one. Cardi B offset. It's gonna be at 11. Two nights before, Tiesto's there. Kicking in the new year with Cardi B. Oh, Table. <laughs> We have tables, we have single admissions. It's gonna be a great time. <laughs> a great time. We're all okay. I'm going well, to be at the Fountain Bleu because uh, you have Marshmallow Khaled turning it up. Turning it up. Got every year Fountain Bleu kind of does something different, something new, but there's always entertainment. There's general admission, there's food, there's premium cocktails, there's cabanas, and there's what? An option to bring in your family. There's everything there. So you can have for the 21 and over, you can have some drinky drinks. And then for the kids, you can have a great time with the family. Love that, love that. Also here in Broward Plantation is also a great family option. There's the option to go to the Young at Art Museum. Something new that's happening, it's bringing the New Year's Eve. So in case you have kids that don't really want to stay up till midnight, there's an option to do it during the day, tuck them in, have a great time. But not only in Plantation, we can also go to the Miami Children's Museum on the MacArthur Causeway, have some great time there with the kids then make your way over to the beach for more, or the Museum of Discovery and Science here in Fort Lauderdale. There's options. There's options. Is it wrong that this will be the first year <clears throat> that I plan to actually stay up and count down? I'm in bed before 10 every year. It's so hard. <laughs> it's it's hard. so hard to stay up. There's so many things to do during the day. Into I used to be able to do the 5 a.m. and 6 a.m. Not anymore. Not anymore. I'm just tired from the year. <laughs> you know, it's, it's, and it's, what it's a culmination. Been? 